So getting ready for my first day in Parliament was relatively nerve-wracking, um, but there wasn't a lot of time to prepare or, or think about it too much um, as everything was so busy in the weeks leading up to it. I did do something uh, the day before we started and that was to go into the city and buy myself a new Bible to be sworn in on. I wanted to have one that I could continue to get sworn in on hopefully um, and then hopefully pass down later on in life. Um, but in the morning um, we had to get in early, wasn't a lot of time to think about it, just rushing around and there we were getting sworn in. Will the following members come to the table to take the oath? Stephen John Raiden Patterson, Adrian Stephen Pederick, Penelope Kate Pratt, Olivia Madison Sabas. Place your hand on the Bible and repeat after me, stating your full name when I indicate it to you. I, Stephen John Raiden Patterson. I, Adrian Stephen Pedering. I, Olivia Do you swear that I will be faithful and bear true allegiance to Her Majesty Queen Elizabeth II, her heirs and successors according to law? Now, I'm not usually someone who gets too nervous about public speaking, um, but being in the chamber for the first time was incredibly nerve wracking. Um, I remember the first question that I was given to ask during question time, uh, and they were given to us quite quickly so that we could sort of get on our feet and, and, and start the process. And I was shaking as I stood up. Um, I am usually really, really comfortable to speak in front of a crowd, uh, but for some reason that felt completely different. Um, I was really glad that we got that out the way, however, before we made our first speeches, so it wasn't literally the first time we spoke when we made our first speeches, um, but it certainly took a couple of tries to feel comfortable standing in that room um, and um, having watched it so many times before, whether on TV or in the gallery or, or helping former members of parliament as a staff member, uh, it didn't quite feel real sitting in a chair of my own and, and having my own plaque on the desk. 